Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another brand new video. And in today's video, I'm going to be teaching you guys how you guys can make your own shirt on Roblox. Alright, before I start this video, I would like to, um, to tell you guys that you need premium in order to do this. Alright, premium is basically Builders Club if you're wondering. Alright, so really nothing changes. You still need premium to make groups and robux and stuff like that all right now we have that out of the way let's get into this so the first thing we want to do is that we want to get our template so how we're going to get a template is that we're going to search it up on google so we're going to open a new tab all right go to images and there should be one right here. Alright, just download that. And after you downloaded that, we're going to be going to the Pixlr editor. Alright, it's going to be in the description below. So I'll see you guys there. Now we are here in the Pixlr editor. Now we're going to open image from computer and get our template. After you open your template, now the first thing we're going to do is that we're going to uh, make a new layer. Now how we're going to make a new layer is that we're going to go to this little box saying layers and we're going to pick this little um, thing right here it's going to say a new layer so you click on that and there you go now you have your layer you're going to drag this layer down under the template all right you're going to see why in a bit but now you can decorate this um, pick any color you want it doesn't matter i'm going to use like um this gray just make sure it's not fully black because we're going to be adding shading so right about there there you go, now we're just going to make a huge, huge rectangle like this. And do that. Oh no, this is our chop tool, hold on. No. Um, you want to go to your drawing tool, it's going to be a rectangle and circle icon. And then you can make a, and you can just do this. Just make sure it fits the whole screen, and there you go. Um, your template is now um, all black. So now we're going to be searching for a uh, for shading. All right. There you go. Now we're just going to go back to Google right here and we're just going to search for shading. Alright, so I found this one right here. Alright, so I'm gonna save the image. There you go. Now we're gonna go back to Pixlr. And then we're just gonna pick a layer up here on the top. And then we're gonna go to open image as layer. There you go, now you can see that there are shading on my um, shirt. Now we want to um, make it so it shows our arms. So how we're gonna fix that is we're gonna go to here, our layer one. Actually, you know, we're gonna bring this down once. There you go. Or actually, I think it just looks better to do it like that. So we're going to keep it on layer two. We're going to use this um, 
is what's called and basically we're just gonna calculate this we're gonna do like right here there you go and you're gonna press backspace or delete then you're gonna do the same thing as layer one so you're gonna click on layer one and press backspace There you go. Now, as you can see, we just have a, um, a just a black shirt. We want to add decoration and stuff like that. So, I'm just going to stick with my first layer. Because I want um, the shading to be on top of the text or whatnot. But I'm not going to add any text. So I'm just going to add a, uh, so as you can see, if I go to my Roblox, you can see my mask um, right now. I'm just going to copy the same thing. So I'm just going to go to line and basically just decorate this however you want. So you see you guys in a bit and I'll tell you how this looks. And there you go, guys. I think my shirt looks good. All right. So what we're going to do is that we're going to go to File right here. It's going to be on the top left, and we're going to press Save. Now, make sure that your format is PNG. All right, so it's transparent, and it's full quality. All right, and then you can just change the name, do whatever you want. There you go, now you're pretty much done. You can exit out of this. You can exit out of this as well. And now we're gonna go back to Roblox. Now I'm gonna go to my group and I'm gonna upload this. Oh yeah, if you wanna upload it, you need to go to create up here. And you just want to go down to shirts. And if you're doing this for a group, go to group um, creations, upload it there. If you're just doing it um, from your avatar, then go to my creations. But I'm going to do this from my group. And there you go. Now I'm going to choose the file. Now we're going to name this. Now, what you guys can do if you want to name this is that you can go to this website. I'm also going to link it in the description. And basically, what you can do with this is that you can pick your own symbols and stuff like that. As you can see, so these are all the cool looking symbols you can put in your um, name so you can name it right there's the check marks there's uh, um, I don't know the HD all right and if there's also these bold looking ones but what's even what's even more cool is that it has emojis but it also has cool fonts so we're going to go to emojis first and we're going to go to cool fonts and then here we can pick any emoji i'm going to pick the fire emoji right here we can go back to develop and then we can name our shirt here Then we can go to cool fonts and look at all these fonts here. There's a ton of fonts you can use and they pretty much all look 
a really cool one to you put on your shirt so if I just do fire now look at all these cool looking fonts you can use I can use this one or I think yeah I think the best ones have to be um, this one right here or the bold script font they both look good anything that's bold is basically good alright so I suggest using bold fonts alright I just they, I just, it just looks cooler so if I just copy this And there you go, look how cool that looks. I'm just gonna go simple. Upload it. And then there you go, you have made your own shirt. Now if you just want to make um, Robux from that shirt, then of course you can edit it, you know, change the description, the sales, you know, how much you want to sell it for. I'm going to sell this for 10 Robux, alright? I'm going to send this for 10 Robux. I'm going to put this in the description below as well. So you guys can check it out for yourself. Alright. And there you go. You just need to wait a couple of minutes. And you're pretty much done. Alright. That's going to be it for this video. If you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to drop a like and sub. And yeah. Check out the playlist of all of the Roblox tutorial that I made. You will not regret it. Alright. Alrighty then guys, I'm gonna end the video off here. Again, if you enjoyed this video, if this worked, again drop a like. If you have any suggestions, make sure to leave them in the comments below. I do post every day, alright, and I do live streams every Saturday and Sunday. Other than that, peace guys.